hand, he can't catch it. That's the rule, as long as he just slaps it away. Twisting and turning, good ball inside, but nobody's there really. Apart from Mike Russell, who says thank you, and off it goes. Now Lovett are camped in the Newton Moore half. And just becoming a bit more difficult for Newton Moore to get the ball out, Fraser, and they're drifting deeper and deeper as the game progresses. Yeah, well, that's what happens quite often, is if you're not clearing the ball at your defence, your forward line starts to come deeper, your midfield starts to come deeper, and against a wind, that becomes an even bigger issue. Just seeing the far side there, Paul John McIntosh prowling in the box. He's very conscious, I think, of the way the team is falling deeper and deeper, because here's another bomb coming. Long, fast, high ball, and there's a chance here for Lovett. Yes, it's a goal, and it's Mark McLaughlin, and it's that simple, simplest of tactics. They don't have a long ball in on the keeper, and it's trouble on a day like this. Well, what happened there is three Newton Moore players went for the ball, and they basically forgot about Mark McLaughlin. He was in behind, and when the ball dropped, he took the chance. Here's the high ball coming in. There's all the Newton Moore defenders lined up. Mark's on to it. Paul kind of got his feet to a wee bit, but couldn't keep it out. Ball drops in behind. Mark's there, simple touch, and basically what Mark McLaughlin's is.